over the rain and city. Selling dope, I'm hot as fuck. Hot. Bro, I can't do no chilling. Went from robbing boys to men. Ooh. I feel like Michael B. First on Fox, a gruesome discovery in Pinellas County where witnesses found this almost 14 foot gator with a body in its mouth this afternoon. This happened in the Ridgecrest community along 134th Street near Olmerton Road. Fox 13's Justin Matthews is out there live for us tonight. And Justin, I know you've been out there all afternoon. You actually spoke to a witness who saw this and went to get help. What did he have to say? Yeah, it's a terrifying story. The witness I spoke to says he saw this gator in the water, ran to this fire station behind me, not too far. It's only about 400 feet from where he saw that huge, huge alligator. I was on my way to a job interview, and I was always looking to the lake just, you know, for fish and stuff, and I, I spotted the gator. Jamarcus Bullard says he took a good look at it and noticed something was in the gator's mouth. I noticed it had a body in its mouth, like a lower torso, so once I saw that, I ran straight to the fire department and got them. They confirmed it was the body. Bullard says seeing something like that is surreal and tragic. I thought it was fake. It was my first time seeing a gator in real life as well, so I was just like, it was pretty cool, but like once I saw what it had, I was like, is that like a mannequin body? It, it looked it like it was pale and white. After alerting the fire department, dozens of Pinellas County Sheriff's deputies and FWC officers got to the scene. A huge response along 134th Street North off of Olmerton Road in Largo. Sky Fox overhead showing a large alligator on the ground. Investigators looking for answers. All of this in close proximity to a head start and a boys and girls club. All I keep thinking about is like all these little kids that go to school right behind me and they come this way every single day. Others who live nearby say they've seen some small alligators in the area before, but nothing quite like this. And in a place where there are a lot of pedestrians. I mean, that it could have been anybody, you know. It's scary to think about. And Bullard says, with gators around, he's not going to be doing much walking in his neighborhood anymore. I'm going to get me a bike or start catching a bus to work. Because, I mean, it's, it's, they don't have any gates or anything like that. They got small little like gates, but somebody dies. Yeah, I mean, FWC confirmed tonight that the alligator is just under 14 feet long, as you heard, and it was uh, killed humanely. The agency says a body was found in the waterway with the gator, but the FWC isn't saying anything about who this victim is and if that, uh, that body has anything to do with uh, the alligator, if, if the alligator actually killed a person. That is still uh, to be determined tonight. Reporting live in Largo, Justin Matthews, Fox 13 News. Yeah, 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 what it do, this your boy, your dog, Red Dummy, you already know what it is, man, welcome to the Switch Spot, and today, we got some crazy, crazy shit going on, bruh, I mean, it's really normal in Florida, bruh, I don't know if, you know what I'm saying, it was a disposal of an op, or, you know what I'm saying, somebody just walking past, you know what I'm saying, and they just got caught up in the mix of a 14 foot alligator, bro. That's that's like a that's like a a, a Yukon, bro. Like you walk past and you see an alligator on the sidewalk or, or right there, the size of a Yukon, bro. Yeah, that ain't no normal stuff, bro. Like I said, I'm in Miami right now. I done seen a alligator before you feel what i'm saying and, and i'm talking about they be in the canals and all that i done seen one crossing the street one day but i ain't never seen one of them ones like you know what i'm saying that, that's super big and you know what i'm saying that's mobile and, and and off the land and not right there by the water but i don't know if dude went over there by the water you know what i'm saying or it could have been a you know what I'm saying? Somebody trying to dispose a body and just threw the body in the water. You know what I'm saying? Hoping that the alligator swallow him whole, dog. It goes down out here like that, man. You know what I'm saying? You ain't gotta just go to the Everglades to get it in. You can just straight go to a canal out here, bruh. Alligators eat anything. They dispose of any type of meat, bruh. You know what I'm saying? But obviously, dude won't all the way good to him. You know what I'm saying? Alligator won't feel a dude like that because he left a piece of them or a lot of them right there from what I heard or what I seen. And just to imagine, it was right there by a boys and girls club, bruh. Yeah, that's the crazy part. Kids had to, 
you know what I'm saying? I hope they ain't get to see it, you know what I'm saying? Cause that's some, that's some, some stuff you'll never forget, bruh. But it's some Florida stuff, bruh. It's some Florida stuff. You just, you know what I'm saying? You gonna hear about some crazy stuff out here. Alligators, monkeys, uh, lizards, uh, pythons, whatever, bruh. That's Florida for you, man. But RIP to the uh, person who was in the alligator mouth, man. You already know, man. Wish you the best of luck. Wish your family the best of luck. You know what I'm saying? Until then, make sure y'all drop them likes. Make sure y'all subscribe right now, bruh. I need everybody to subscribe, man. Turn my page all the way up, bruh. And you already know, if you woke up broke, you should never went to sleep. Yeah.